Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. What up guys today is something a little bit different. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can download and play Modern Warfare 2 on Xbox One. If you guys didn't know, Modern Warfare 2 is backwards compatible right now, which pretty much means it's still the same game. You can still play this on the 360, but now you have an option to get on your Xbox One and play the game again. So for anyone that did get rid of the 360 or, you know, it broke or anything like that, if you still want to play this game, you can get on your Xbox One and be able to play this with your 360 friends or Xbox One friends, it really doesn't matter. So there's two different versions or, or ways you can actually play this game. The first way is if you have the digital um, download, which pretty much uh, you go to your store, I'm going to show you guys in a little bit, and you download it through there. Or if you have the disc, all you have to do is insert it into your tray. You have to do like a little update, I'm pretty sure it's like 500 megabytes or something like that. Once you do that update, you'll be able to click on the game. It's going to make you sign into your 360 account and you'll be able to play it once again with your 360 friends or anyone from the Xbox One. But the way I'm actually going to show you guys is how you can play this through the store, because I do understand sometimes this doesn't show up uh, depending on how much traffic it has, um, you know, because it is new and it's released uh, backwards compatible. So sometimes it might not even show up in your store. And um, I'm pretty much going to show you guys how you can find this really fast. So what you want to do is go to your store, you want to go to the search box, and once you're in the search box, you want to type in Modern Warfare 2. Do not type in MW2 because it's not going to show up for some reason. I'm not sure if it's glitched or um, if it's just made like that, but what you want to type in is Modern Warfare 2. And once you type that in, you are going to get this result, and you guys can see right here, it says Modern Warfare 2. Now you click on this, and there's going to be two different screens you will see. One is if you had this game digitally downloaded already on the 360, if you did, and you played this on this account, you will see a bar, or you will see a screen like this, but it's going to say install. If you did, once again, buy this on the 360, all you have to do is install it, and boom, you'll be able to play it. If you didn't, like me, I didn't really play this game uh, through digitally download, I have it on the disc, so you're going to see this uh, screen, and it's going to see uh, it's going to say see price. This game, unfortunately, is $15. Uh, you guys can see right now, you click this, and you will see the price. It is $15, which kind of sucks. Um, I'm pretty sure in a GameStop, if you go to GameStop or, um, you know, any any other store that's selling uh, used video games, you can get this for like $3, $4, or even $5 instead of paying $15. Bucks. But once again, if you're lazy, if you don't, you know, want to go out uh, to the store or whatever, you could just buy this for $15. And pretty much all you do is click on Continue, provide your PayPal information, provide your credit card, whatever you're paying with, and you'll be able to download it. Now, keep in mind, if this doesn't show up to you, because this is kind of new released, um, this got announced like an hour ago or something like that. So if you are in Canada or or Europe or, or Mexico, whatever you are, if this screen doesn't show up, if this game doesn't show up on your Xbox, one, you can hard reset your Xbox by um, holding the, like the little Xbox button on, on the box itself, holding it for like five to six seconds, and then your Xbox is going to shut off, you're going to turn it back on, and you should be able to see this in your store. Now, if you don't see this after that, then sometimes, uh, once again, it's glitchy, and it's not going to show up for a few hours, so all you really have to do is wait till it actually shows up. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much how you download it, that's pretty much how you play this game on Xbox One. Once again, if you guys have any issues, let me know in the comment section below, I respond to all my comments, but once again, that's it for the video, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.